Hey girl campers, this is Ainsley, your Kentucky chapter guide, and I am here with Rayma Waters, the Ohio guide, and she is out at Whispering Hills Campground this weekend in Georgetown. And um, we're gonna run around today and, and see a little bit of Kentucky. And I love Rayma's Class C, and she's gonna show us around inside. Hi everyone, it first starts with my, um, my door. Uh, I love finding decals of places that I go. And it, um, when the door is closed and I'm sitting drinking my coffee in the morning and I'm looking at that, all I have is great memories. All right, come on in, let's take a look. So, um, I love my Class C, it's a diesel. Uh, I bought it, it was my retirement gift to me because I knew that I really wanted to travel. Everything here is picked up along the way. Uh, it didn't look like this in 2016 when I bought it, but uh, everything, um, you know, it's got a story. I didn't just go pull decor out. And, uh, and now I'm at a point when I find something that is a must, uh, something's got to go, right? As my husband says, uh, is the idea to, square, uh, to cover every square inch of this place? But I want to point out something here. I ended up buying all six of them. These are the Ohio State Park uh, posters. And uh, my husband and I framed those and I have six, but I don't have enough wall space. So guess what? At home, I have a, what we call the camp bedroom and for guests. And so it's full of stuff that got rejected out of here or there was no room, but some of my favorite things. So, um, I'm a Oklahoma girl at heart, born and bred, but, um, marriage, uh, caused me to move to Cincinnati and, and 20, no, 2006. And, uh, but you'll see a uh, little bits and pieces of that Oklahoma girl and, um, it's been fun and uh, uh, just find your style. And with me, it all started with this blanket. I love the Glacier um, uh, Pendleton stuff. And I had that and I didn't know what I was gonna do with it. And then I went from a vintage camper, um, which I had to sell because I knew with me going cross country, uh, once I retired that, uh, but that wasn't going to be the safest way to travel for me. And so um, that's with the, the Class C. My husband doesn't camp. Um, and that's what I love about girl campers. I can stay busy year round and do the things that I love and chase that 70 degree weather. Um, but I had this Pendleton blanket and that's what started the whole darn thing here. And you know what I love? I love... I love these on the floor, these cow hides, they're awesome. And then I also like the way that you've hung your curtains here to separate um, from the driving space. Like yeah. I, it just, I, it's a I kept cozy thinking nook. when I walked in, I was like, where's the driver's seat? Cause it just, it looks, I mean, it just yeah. makes it look like a totally different. Yeah. And you know that as we talk in Girl Camper from factory to fabulous, when you buy these things new, uh, they, they're full of polyester and they kind of look like a hotel room. And I wanted mine to kind of have this vibe national park, uh, Western theme. And, uh, so, you know, I did take, uh, curtains down and bedspread and went with the chambray and uh and did the the buffalo check in the that that color uh, a couple of things um you're right this now oh gosh should i even open this <laughs> this is a storage and um but it is a whole double bed and um and it's got a tv but you know when i'm camping i don't even know how to turn that thing on. I, I never watch TV. There, there's too many other important things to do. So it stays up against the wall there. Uh, the, my ladder is full of all my accessories. And, um, but my, um, if it let only one person camp with me, I'm one of those that camping, it, I love the social aspect with other girl campers, but I need my space. But I do have a long bestie, uh, from my Oklahoma days and uh, Merith uh, Means. And she's been known to climb up here. And come on in, Loretta. Yes, we're we're, cool. we're, we're doing cool? you Yeah, you're on film, street. girl. Come yeah. on in. We're being filmed. Come on <laughs> oh. in. Uh, and oh, so this is my acquisition here. This and this. If you all know Kay England, I mean, Kay England is the rock star in the quilting business. and. 
Um, this particular quilt, uh, so Kay uh, was get, getting rid of some of her quilts and I jumped on that thing and um, she designed the fabric for this and she quilted it she signed it and if you uh she's legendary so if uh google up that girl uh she she's um, a, a national treasure when it comes to quilts and then i uh, got that one and so these are my new acquisitions from kentucky uh and i had that great pleasure i think i posted on the ohio site a picture of k and i and um so you know, and guess what she gave me in return? Her and Karen Reichardt. I got a cute little candle. I love it. It's one of those Ray Dunn things. Um, and I just love it. It's got the TP there. Couldn't be better. But uh, that's what I love. Um, my bag right here, some girls, I was at the Red River 101. And oh, I, that's that was really my neat. acquisition in uh, Durant. A uh, couple of us went to town and I saw that and I said, Oh my gosh, I gotta have it. And it, you know, when you're camping, you need as many uh, storage units as possible. And so, um, anyways, um, this is this is Runaway Ray Ray. Uh, that's her tag name. Uh, my grandkids call me Ray Ray, and they kind of worry that uh, I'm always on the run. So uh, it's not that I'm on the run. I'm just running to camp with you girls. So see you down the road. Thank you.